What's up, Creepers and Geekers Chris, the Atari Creep. How is everyone doing today? So a couple of nights ago, me and one of the little misses went to go see Sonic, the Hedgehog movie. And I did promise I'd come on. It's been, wow, a week and a half or so. Oh, I just almost dropped a, I got a cool poster I was going to show you. Here we go, I'll show it to you now then. It's got the stuffs on the back to do activities for the kiddos. Got one for her, one for me. Um... But I said I'd come on here and talk about it. So I'm not just going to talk about the movie. Because to be perfectly honest with you, there's not a lot to talk about. <laughs> Let's put it this way. It was a good movie. I got more out of it than the little lady did. Because I know the Sonic franchise. Uh, and if you're a fan of the franchise, you're going to get a lot more out of it. If you don't know anything about Sonic the Hedgehog. You just want something cool to take your kid to. This is a good movie for that. Um, it's, a, it, it, it's not anything that's groundbreaking if you've seen any movie from the 90s that's kind of in this style you've seen the movie but it was done very well um it kept you entertained it wasn't too boring so to speak and you could tell the people involved really cared about the project itself the the the, the property the, the name sonic they cared and they knew what they were talking about so rather than sit here and try to talk about the game and i mean the movie at nauseum, because other than that, that's really, I mean, Jim Carrey, we can talk about Jim Carrey. Um, Jim Carrey is very 90s Jim Carrey, and I've seen a lot of people praising that. And if you like Jim Carrey from the 90s, then guess what? You're going to be happy as fuck. I don't. <laughs> I don't like, I liked Ace Ventura Pet Detective when it first came out. It was a funny fucking movie. Um... Me and my friends would have fun for hours quoting the goddamn thing. Hours. Oh, damn it. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, hours. But it's, it's, it's kind of like the Adam Sandler thing, too. You know, there's only so much fucking baby talk I can listen to. And if that's all you've got to offer, it's the... Doo -doo 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 -doo, you know? Fucking stupid. To me, anyway. To me, it's stupid. But, if you've missed that 90s crazy Jim Carrey, I don't want to go that way. I want to go up and over. Arr, you motherfucker. That's, that's what I hate about these fucking boing boing things. That's what I called them when I was a kid. I want to go around the boing boing. It's my prerogative. I'm not here to actually play the game. You guys know the fucking game. I just want to get through it. <laughs> I just want to get through it for fuck's sake. Oh no, I should have let myself go down. To that point, point. But um, now overall, it was a really fun movie. I had a good time with it. There's a couple of couple of pokes to the plumber in it. One wicked blatant one that I don't think I've heard anybody talk about. Um, so the premise of the movie is is he had to leave his world, and he ended up on Earth, and he's supposed to stay a secret. And he's been following this one family, and he just gets so tired of being alone one day, and he draws attention to himself in a big way. He ends up in, in their lives, physically, and, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a cat and mouse game. They're, they're, they're running away from the big baddie, of course, Dr. Robotnik being the baddie. Um, oh, you fucking whore. Oh, well. Oh, shit. I fucked that up, son. Oh, I want to go get an emerald. Um, it, it's kind of like a, you know, we, we got a thing that we need to go get at a place. But we got to avoid this person. You know, let's have some excitement on the way. It, it's that typical kind of fucking thing. But it's fun. So, they, I think they incorporate all the little elements of the game adapted for a fucking movie properly. Wow, it's been a while. Fuck you. Fuck you shooting that shit at me after I lose that ring. Like, they incorporate the rings as portals. And I think that worked out pretty well. And he's only got so many of them. And, you know, if he gets in trouble, he can open up a portal and go to wherever. And just talks to this mushroom world. <laughs> That's a horrible place. Why would anyone want to live there? Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I haven't heard anyone talking about that in any of the fucking reviews. I can't believe it. 
I cannot believe it. Wee! I, I used to love doing that. I don't know why. I don't know why. But no, it's a it's it's a, it's a great movie. I don't know if I would pay to see it again. I, I'm going to wait for Netflix or something like that, you know. Or, or possibly just get it. I will say this, though. There's a, an opening. You know, how, like, Marvel has their thing. And, you know, so Sega has their own entertainment division logo thing before the movie. And it's fucking awesome. <laughs> it's just awesome. Let me pause this. It's got all, like, the game screenshots. And I was up there screaming all the games. And, and the people around me, you could tell they were kind of, like, they remember Sega from the 90s. Uh, but they, you know, they're not really into it modern day. It's just more of a nostalgic trip for them, and they're introducing their kids to it. And maybe they'll go out and get a, a Genesis Mini. Um, my birthday's in a week or two. Maybe I'll get one. But, uh... <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh my god! Golden Axe! Oh, it's Altered Beast! Eating the balls! They're all just like, alright, dude, relax. Relax, man, sorry. The sold-out show. I'll tell you that. There was only like six fucking six seats left when we got there to buy the tickets. And luckily we were able to get a seat where we liked it. You know? But it was a sold out show. Um Yeah, just I think I think Sonic's personality was perfect. Whoever portrayed him, I'm sorry, I don't I'm not that kind of a review channel. Um the individual who voiced Sonic. I think they did a fantastic job capturing the, uh, the character of Sonic the Hedgehog. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's worth seeing at least once. I think, okay, so they open it up to, uh, there's a couple, like, little things at the end. Stick around, stick around. That's one of those flicks. Um, I mean, of course, you see... Robotnik Eggman, whatever you want to call him. What did you call him? Leave a comment down below. I call him Robotnik. I don't remember calling him Eggman back then. Maybe I did. Maybe it's reverse. I have a memory issue, so I don't remember a lot of my youth, my past. Um, but when he when he finally looks like Doctor Robotnik, the big mustache and everything, and I'm not gonna say when that happened because it, 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 it eventually happens. I think it looks perfect. Oh, 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 I got glitched. Glitched. That's what happens when you fucking emulate. You know what I mean? Oh, let's, go get a, let's go get a Chaos Emerald, shall we? That's what happens when you emulate. I have this game, so anyone who doesn't like emulation can suck a dick. Um, they leave things open to a sequel, and I think, I think it's worth it. I think it's worthy of the sequel that... I hope is coming. I hope. I hope. It, it looks like it's going to be a fun franchise. I just hope they don't drive it into the fucking ground. It's the left or the right? God, it's been so long. I thought this next round started. Ah, you motherfucker. Well, I'm not going to get the first Chaos Emerald. I'm going to look like a complete douchebag. I'm gonna look like a douchebag. So we're gonna sit here and just try to play Sonic for a little while. You, you have my whole thoughts on the movie. It's it's a, it's a good flick. I, I would definitely go see it. I would go see it once. Um, I think it's worth it. It's not a big spectacle. It's nothing that you haven't seen before. And I went into it expecting exactly what I got out of it. Uh, I was pleasantly surprised about how well it was made. Um, ooh, I got an emerald! It's all the chaos! Oh shit, I'm almost out of fucking coffee. Motherfucker! Be nice if they... Ugh, fuck you. I hate those things. I always end up getting fucked by them. For real. Oh, man. For a guy who's not good at fucking platforms, you know the anxiety I'm having right now. <laughs> oh, 
Do I drown the fucking guy? We'll find out. We'll find out. It would be nice to see if Tails showed up and the Shadow and all the guys. I want to see all the guys. I want to see all the guys. It'd be great to see it become a become a thing. I would enjoy it anyway. Fuck, fuck! Alright. Alright, 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 alright. This is one of my... <laughs> I'm sure this happened to a lot of people. This was my first pitfall in gaming. Major pitfall. After you kill this fucking guy, you can still die. I'm sure all you know that now. But I just fucking figured, oh, he's dead. I can just go over there. I fell right into, fucking, fell right into that purple shit. He got dead. God damn it, why do I gotta film these things when no one's home? I need a beverage. I need more coffee. You know what, and here, here's, this is my Achilles heel, this, this, this fucking, I don't know what it is about this level. Maybe it's the, the liquid, maybe it's the, maybe it's more because of, oh, you cocksucker. Oh, fuck you all. Maybe it's the whole drowning thing. But once I get past this, oh, and you know what? The casino, the casino boss fucks with me. But after that, this game's a fucking breeze to me. I don't know why these earlier ones are a little tougher for me. You know, I'm going to have to do a live stream and just marathon this game. I got to marathon some game. I got I to gotta, I gotta give you guys a live stream that's fucking worth, that's worth actually watching. I mean, I, I know sitting here watching me play a couple of Atari games is fun. On the occasion, um, but I should fucking start live streaming the proper way. Yes, I always avoid that. I don't know why. Maybe I'm a glutton for punishment. I like being down here in the in the sludgy fucking swamps of the underbelly. You fucking cunt! I gotta find an air chute. I need to find air. There you go. No. There you go. The tail shot. <laughs> Fuck him. I always hated him. Actually, I'm going to take this opportunity to get some air. Take some opportunity to get some air. Fucking things. I hate those fucking things. Ooh. Sluggish motherfucker. There we go. There we go. We're good. Ah, yeah. Fucking hate bees. What about the bees? Well, fuck the bees. They took my rings. I hate your fucking bees. Motherfucker ain't the bees' knees. Ah, you bitch. How did I fuck that up? How do you fuck that up? Call being fucking rusty, kid. Yeah. Eat that shit, motherfucker. Uh, nah, 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 nah. 
This is such a fun, such a fun level. This is some iconic shit right here. It's frustrating, but wicked fun. Frustrating, nonetheless. I like it. Ah, oh, you bitch. I thought I was going to get over that. Guess what? I thought wrong. But I am fucking horrible at defeating the boss in this level. I don't know what it is. I just, I panic. I can't. <laughs> it's like this, this, this. I don't know how to describe it. It's like a cadence that you have to get into. And back in the day, I was all right at doing it. I just, I don't know. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. Get up on the block, you fuck. There we go. You gotta watch out for getting smushed and shit here, too. Yeah, let's get some points while we're down here. And that, that that's another great thing about the Sonic games. They, they reward you for exploring. Reward you for it. Eee! I didn't want to go up that side. I'll just keep going that way. <laughs> I'll just keep doing it. Oh, I fucking hate this. Get over there. Fuck it, I'll just go down this way. No! Go over. Go over the fucking thing. I'm going to be trapped in this fucking never ending loop. Yeah, guys, sorry. This is where you want to shut the video off. <laughs> this is where you go, okay, you know what? The creep might be fun to listen to from time to time. But he ain't fun to watch play games. So, fuck this kid. I'm out. Viewer, out. Plunger wasn't going down. We. I just want to do that to smash the fucking head. So does anyone like Tails? Does anyone give a fuck about Tails? I don't. I most certainly do not like Tails. Oh! Except for when he gives me rings. Except for when he gives me rings. I'll take it. Excuse what I'm doing with my face, my nose is itchy. Oh, itchy nose. <clears throat> Let's give me a long ass video. Long ass video. We might have to continue this. I don't like keeping my videos too long. I don't know how anyone could fucking sit and watch a watch a video this long. But they do. People do. I don't know how anyone can sit here and watch other people fucking play video games. But they do. Bing, boing, 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 boing. Reminds me of this data one I watch. I gotta start collecting fucking rings here. Kind of the whole fucking purpose of this, isn't it? Fucking fine, I guess I'm not going in there. Whee!
No, go back down there. Get the stuffs. No one ever said hedgehogs were smart, okay? I don't know why I like bonsai these things, guys. Sorry. That ain't no thing. Oh, can I get in there? Get in there. Oh, I want the chaos. Yay. I won't get it, though. <laughs> I've never been good at these either. Oh, I don't have the re... I, you know what? I didn't have the reflexes then. Never mind fucking now. One ring to go. Where, where are they? Just give me one. <laughs> I had a fight to get those 50 rings. Holy shit. Oh, this is going to be a fucking nightmare. I jumped. Fucking asshole. Alright, I've lost this one. Fuck you. Yeah, I know. Oh, no! Oh, well. Oh, well. That's what I think of you. Sorry, Charlie. Yeah, I got something out of it, though. Wasn't a chaos ammo. Oh, I don't know. I'm going to get fucking stuck in here now. Such a great looking level too. Sounds great, looks great, it's fun. You know, back when video games were fucking fun. You remember those days? No? You're fucking busy playing Call of Booty. Modern fucking warfare 1600. When I was playing Sonic 12. <laughs> you see the irony there? Uh, no, no. Stop getting stuck. Stop getting stuck, you dumb fuck. Oh. I'm getting close. So at least do that. All right, here we go. Tails, come on. Uh, come on, you fuck. Do what I tell you to. I used to have the rhythm. The rhythm's gonna get you. See, this is what ends up happening. And then I lose my ring. And then I get dead. Let's see if I can do it without more rings. Let's see if I can do it without the ring. Ah, oh, I almost got him. You know, I'm calling it there. I'm calling it there for now, anyway. So, you know about the movie. You've seen me play Sonic the Hedgehog. Maybe one of these days we will we will do an actual stream. Oh, I, I looked down to make sure I was even recording. That would have sucked, but... I don't know. Yeah, it's a good movie. I, I say it's worth going to see it. Jim Carrey is typical 90s Jim Carrey, so if you like that, that's cool. I think they incorporated the, the game into a movie as best as they could, and it, it turned out a lot better than I thought it was. And it was pretty much everything I anticipated, so... Let me know down in the comments if you've seen the movie what you think. Uh, what do you think of this game? This game is amazing! And once I get past this level, I swear to God, it's like a fucking walk in a park. I don't understand what it is about that one boss. I can't fucking seem to beat easily. But I will beat it here in a second. And maybe I'll just leave the game where it is and we'll continue from there. I don't know. But either way, guys, go ahead and leave feedback. Thumbs up, thumbs down, all feedback to 
the creep is positive. Thank you always so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Until next time, take care. Creep it real.